Please remain standing for the national anthem. Present art. <laughs> Please be seated. So greetings, Toya Chargers. We're so thrilled that you're here tonight to celebrate these young children and all that they have accomplished over the last, who knows how many years, 13 years of schooling. So if you can think back to when they were five years old and parents, do you remember dropping them off and saying goodbye to them? There might have been a few tears when that happened. And tonight, I'm sure there'll be a few tears as well. So we, we want to honor you this evening, and there's lots of people here to support you. So first, I'd like to introduce the people on the stage with me, and then we will go ahead and get started. So our honored guest and keynote speaker will be Dr. Gabriel Trujillo. We also have TUSD board member, Ms. Natalie Luna Rose. And we have our Region 1 Assistant Superintendent, Mr. Brian Lambert. And then you have the administration from Choya High School. We have our principal, Mr. Cesar Miranda. We have our assistant principal, Tariq Rasul. 
And then we have our counselors, our IB coordinator up here as well, and they will be assisting with distributing the diplomas later. Lastly, I'd like to introduce AP, Kathy Adams, and she would like to share a few words about things that have happened this year. Thank you, Mrs. Ingram. For those of you that don't know, 2023 was a challenging year to be a charger for many different reasons. But the reason I'm here to speak to you tonight is we lost two of the greats this year. The first person that I would like to honor is Mr. Jim McAllister. Mr. McAllister was our auto teacher here at Choya for the last four and a half years. We lost him unexpectedly right after Christmas break. Mr. McAllister joined Choya after working in the automotive industry for more than 20 years. Jim was loved by his students and always had a smile for you when he saw you. He loved sports and he loved cars. He had a passion for both and he loved to share that passion with his students. Mr. McAllister's own children, his twins, are also graduating tonight across town and they're in our thoughts during this momentous time. We honor Jim McAllister tonight and his family. Recently, we lost another famous person, also known as Mr. Choya, if you know who that is, Mr. Ralph Romero. Mr. Romero lost his battle to colon cancer on Friday night when we were at our luau. He was surrounded by family and friends. Ralph started here at Choya in 1984. You guys weren't even born yet. He was a custodian and an equipment manager for many years and an assistant softball coach here at Choya. In December of 2021, we dedicated the Choya softball field and had it renamed the Ralph Romero softball field. So those of you that didn't know why we did that, that's why we did that for Mr. Choya. Ralph was always willing to help anyone in need, and he loved working with all of our sports teams here at Choya. He was also a huge Dallas Cowboy fan. The family has set up a GoFundMe. If you are able to assist, uh, please visit the Choya Facebook page for more information. We would just like to say, Jim and Ralph, please continue to rest in paradise, and you will truly be missed by all chargers. We do want to make an announcement in your program tonight. There is one error in the program, and we apologize profusely for this error. It's the first time in Choya history we have two salutatorians, and only one is named in the program, and we apologize for that. They both have the exact same GPA after being here at Choya for four years, and we're excited to have both of them speak to you tonight. The name that is not printed is Fernanda Castellanos Robles, and we apologize to her and her family for not having her name placed in there. Thank you, Chargers. Next, I'd like to introduce our guest of honor, TUSD Superintendent, Dr. Gabriel Trujillo. Well, good evening, Charger community. This is a wonderful, wonderful occasion for me. It's my first time since becoming superintendent that I'm able to celebrate graduation here in Charger Nation. And though we mourn the loss of two amazing leaders in the Charger community, I don't want to go forward without honoring a current leader here in the Charger community. He's wrapping up 29 years of service in the Tucson Unified School District, 16 years here at Choya. I just walked past him uh, on the way in. I want to congratulate uh, your lead custodian, Mr. Gabriel Cerezo, for all of his years of service and congratulate him on his retirement. And I want to thank him and his team for making such a beautiful space here for us to celebrate this pivotal moment in your lives. One more time, a round of applause for Mr. Cerezo. You know, graduates, more than anything else, I think you need to realize that graduation, it's one of the few moments in your entire life where actually every single person in your life that you love and cherish the most that loves you unconditionally, they're actually in the same place and time to celebrate you. And it's really impossible for me, being an older dude, and you being so young and being in the sunshine of your youth, for you to truly understand how important that is and how few those occasions are in your life where everybody you love most in the world is actually here one place in time to celebrate you. So I hope that you really, really appreciate this moment because graduation, it is a time of hope, happiness, pride, peace, 
And it's a time when adolescence ends and adulting begins. It's that time where you realize that there's no more first hour, second period, third hour. It's just there's life and there's no bell schedule. There's nobody trying to tell you where to go and what you need to do. And though all of you are a celebration of diversity and uniqueness in your individuality and in your stories, your experiences, your passions, your truths that you bring here, there is one thing that each and every single one of you as Choya graduates and as leaders in a new world, one thing that you all have in common. Because see, when the lights go down in the next 90 minutes and when the celebration is over, all of you are going to share one resource that all of you have, regardless of where you came from, the language you speak, your background, one resource that you never really truly appreciate until it's gone. And then you're going to want more of it. And it's a resource that you can't see, you can't taste, you can't hear, you can't feel it. That resource is time. And time it just moves forward. It doesn't care who you are. It never asks you what your political, religious, or social ideology is. It rewards those that use it wisely. And it is brutal and punishing to those who waste it. Time, many people say, it's life's main ingredient. It's because life is made up of time. And time is made of moments. Guess what moments are made of? They're made of your greatest superpower choices. Choices are yours and yours alone to make. The power in any given situation to choose how you're going to respond, react, and get up when you've been knocked down. So my, my wish for this class of 2023 this evening, my wish for you is that you choose to spend the time of your life being fearless in the person that you were born to be, being fearless in pursuing and growing into the person that you have it in you to be, being fearless in pursuing the dreams and the goals that you have dared to dream at this point, and being fearless in standing up for the people, the passions, the causes that mean the most to you. I also hope that in the moments that will challenge you in this life, moments of loss, disappointment, anger, frustration, bitterness, jealousy, because we're all human, moments of sadness and loss, I pray that you choose grace, kindness, and peace. Because I think you'll see in this life, grace, kindness, peace, and yes, forgiveness, they are some of the most powerful choices and some of the hardest ones to make in life's most challenging situations. It's in these situations that challenge you the most that the power of your choices will go on to define the quality of the lives that you'll lead. You step forward in a crucial time in our nation's history, a time when the world's greatest experiment in governance of the people, for the people, and by the people, it's being tested like it's never been tested before, a time when our beautiful multicultural representative democracy's place and influence in the world is being doubted, it's being questioned. So we turn to you, a new generation of leaders, with the hope that you're going to do things better than my generation did them. The hope that you'll be a new generation of leaders that will take a step back from the toxic tribalism and political warfare that is tearing at the national fabric, and that you'll be a generation of leaders that will take a step forward towards national unity, towards shared common values, towards an investment in community. And so class of 2023, I challenge you to go forward. Spend the time of your lives investing in the strength and the quality of the relationships that you have around you, particularly your family and your loved ones, so that you can go forward and you can lead the companies, the organizations, and the communities that will change the world, raise the new generation of children that will lead the next generation of leaders, be the generation that invents the new technologies, writes the songs, creates the art, and changes our institutions for the better, so that America will continue to flourish as a nation and as a beacon of freedom and light and opportunity the world over. Class of 2023, that is my hope for you. You are my light for the future. I congratulate you, and I want to wish you all the best in good health, happiness, and a life well lived. Congratulations again.
Thank you, Dr. Trujillo. Next, we have Principal Cesar Miranda, and he will address the graduating class. Seniors, today is when you take a moment to live in the moment and enjoy the fruits of your labor. This is sometimes a challenge because it's in our nature to want to move forward and plan for the next big thing. Please remember that this is a milestone in your lives and it deserves full recognition. But this is not just your special day. It is a special day for your teachers, your family, and friends, and whoever has helped you and supported you along the way. Make sure to take time today or this weekend to say thank you to all that have helped you here tonight. This is my first official year here as principal, and I'm learning a lot and what it truly means to be a proud Choya Charger. Seniors, thank you because you've shown me in your actions that being a Charger means something special. Thank you because you are what makes this school an amazing place to be. Today, you are the stars of the night and the pride and glory of your community. Continue to make us proud, continue to grow and shine bright in whatever you do. So I'll end with this. Glory to you, Chargers, orange and blue, lightning speed, Charger true. Thank you and have an amazing and safe night. Thank you, Mr. Miranda. Next, the counselors will present the Merit of Excellence Top 25, and then we will have our student speeches. Yeah. Students, when your name is called, please come forward. We do a hard George. Chair. Yeah. You guys ready? Number twenty five with a GPA of three point eight two, Vincent A. Redden. Vincent? Oh, gosh. Thank you. Sure. Sure. <laughs> yeah, excellent. Number 24, GPA 3.84, Salma Para. Yeah, you got it. At number 23, GPA 3.875, Francisco A. Quintana Espino. Okay. At number 22, GPA 3.8750, Mariana Castellanos. Thank you, Councilor. We'll click you. At number 21, GPA 3.8770, Lázaro A. Cota, Jr. Number 20, GPA 3.8800, Annalise K. Montiel. <laughs> As you're coming up, please come up from where Ms. Uh, Ingram is. And then come see your counselors. They can't wait to put that cord on you. At number 19, GPA 3.8890, Carlos A. Yanes. <laughs> Number 18, GPA 3.8940, Monique A. Loya. Number 
school. Number 17, GPA 3.9110, Hector A. Torres Valenzuela. Number 16, GPA 3.9150, Priscilla M. Lopez Garcia. Number 15, GPA 3.9330, Alondra J. Saldana. Number 14, GPA 3.9350, Roberto J. Higuera, Jr. Yeah. Number 13, GPA 3.9620, Aleshka A. Saucedo Fuentes. G Number 12, GPA 3.9640, Elias M. Guzman. Number 11, GPA 4.0000, Kiara S. Montiel. And number 10, GPA 4.0110, Samia Q. Martin. Number 9. Two. GPA 4.0190, Caitlin R. Greener. Number 8, GPA 4.0580, Mark A. Perez. Number 7, GPA 4.0740, Tavia F. Acedo. Number six, GPA 4.1350, Santiago F. Leon. Oh, right back at that though. Oh, at number five, GPA 4.1550, Adrian F. Gomez Cota. <laughs> At number four, at GPA 4.1730, Kristen R. Parkhurst. So number two, GPA 4.1920, Gabriel I. Rivas. Also at number two, GPA 4.1920, Fernanda Castellanos Robles. And your valedictorian at number one with a GPA of 4.4460, Elena C. Valenzuela. All the way. You stay on stage. Staying on stage. Right there. Our first speech is from our valedictorian, Elena Valenzuela. Huh. <laughs> What's up, Chula? It's an honor to be your valedictorian this year. Um, first, I want to thank God for allowing me to be on the 
the stage without um, his strength and his support, I wouldn't be up here speaking with y'all. I also want to thank my family, especially my mom, uh, Rebecca, my ex and my dad, Alfredo Valenzuela, for supporting me and encouraging me to do my best and to just go above and beyond. I also want to thank the rest of my family, yeah, and then um, my friends. They made this a great two years here at Choya. And my teachers, who not only did they help me graduate, but they also made sure that I was ready for college and ready for life overall. So I want to thank them for being more than just their jobs and being a great part of my life. So I didn't have the pleasure of being at Choya for four years. Sorry, I didn't have the pleasure of being at Choya for four years. Okay, that's mine. Um, <laughs> but I did come for uh, for here after after COVID, and um, I actually moved schools around thirteen times. So I've been hopping around Arizona my whole life. Um, and this was kind of like my first public school. And I wasn't expecting so many fire drills to happen this year. <laughs> but I also wasn't expecting a, such a great community to blossom from so many students. I've never felt so close to a community. And I felt that even though there was like, what, 300 of us in this class and even like more than a thousand overall in the school, that we were able to have fun and we were able to like come together and cherish the, the same moments and the same experiences that we're gonna bring with us after this graduation ceremony. Um, I know that COVID was hard, that we all kind of came out from COVID as juniors. Um, a lot of us had that, that really bad work ethic that Zoom gave us. And, um, and we all had those masks. I, I got a lot of acne scars from that, so. I, I bet you're all with the, dealing with that as well. So I'm really glad that we also went through that together. But we also had our pep assemblies and we also had our homecomings that were really greatly planned and we all really enjoyed it. We have such great spirit here at Choi and I hope that continues past our class. So I think the most important thing to take from this is that we need a community like this after we graduate from high school. It's important to grab whoever we can closest to us and really cherish the people that we're surrounded by because we're COVID's not the worst thing that's probably going to happen in our, in our lives, honestly, but that doesn't mean that we're not going to have great moments too. So I just hope that we can all like, you know, maybe if we don't stick together, that we can stick together like we did here later on in our lives. Thank you so much for this. And I hope you guys have great futures ahead of you. All right, since we have two salutatorians, we will start with Fernanda Castellanos Robles. Hello, good evening and buenas tardes, marhaba. Um, I'm Fernanda for those who don't know me. Um, and I'm so proud to say that we're finally graduating. <laughs> This is our moment to enjoy and celebrate for all the beautiful memories and accomplishments we all made together throughout our high school careers. However, this is also a moment to say thank you. Thank you to all the staff members for their support and encouragement. Thank you to the cafeteria staff for the warm meals. Thank you to our principal, Mr. Miranda, and the principal assistants for maintaining the school at ease. Thank you to our teachers for taking a big role in our lives. Ms. Frazier, thank you for your kindness. Ms. Botham, Thank you for believing in every single one of us. Ms. Jandali, thank you for the laughs and giggles, but most importantly, your passion for teaching. Thank you, Mr. Aya, for the Chewbacca impressions and the dad jokes, but most importantly, for teaching us the importance of relaxation in a busy world. And thank you, Ms. Bowler, for the constant motivation and enthusiasm for teaching. Abuelo, donde estés. Muchas gracias por el día de matemáticas. And thank you. Um, Ma Mari, gracias por cuidar de mí estos cuatro años y recibirme con los brazos abiertos. 
Mamá, papá, gracias por todo, que a pesar de la distancia me mostraron todo su apoyo y cariño. Sin ustedes no estuviera aquí. And to all my friends and classmates, thank you for all the memories we made together. I will miss Tom Holland stickers in every single corner of the school. That one big snowball fight in March. The big firework round at Ipa that made me and my cousin run out of the building. And of course, the parties that student council organized. And before concluding, I have a message for you, class of 2023. This is not the end, but the beginning of a journey called life. We have been here together for four years. And yes, the high school diploma was our goal. But what mattered was the journey the people we met along the way, and the accomplishments that we all, and the, I'm sorry, the amazing things we all accomplished. In fact, we're celebrating one, and there will be more in the future. Thank you, Class of 2013, and congratulations. Thank you, and our second, Gabriel Rivas. <coughs> Greetings, class of 2023. Before I begin my speech, I would like to thank everyone here today for, for attending our graduation and to all the amazing staff involved in setting up this event. I am tremendously honored and grateful to stand in front of you all today and receiving the award of Salutatorian. This would never have been possible without all the amazing support from our teachers, providing us a tremendous education and constantly pushing us to be our very best. And to all the staff ensuring our campus runs effectively, I thank you. I would also like to thank my fellow seniors, especially those I have been honored to call my friends, for giving me the opportunity to take a break from my obsessive studying and working to simply laugh and have a good time. Although I will admit sometimes a little too much, or else I definitely would have beat you, Elena. <laughs> Lastly, and most importantly, is all my family, who have shown nothing but support and love to me my whole life. So I'd like to give a, sh a quick shout out to all my siblings, my tias Lisette and Lupita, Ofelia, my nannies, Tata, Maurito, and my manina. And so many more I can't name, but I am forever grateful to you all. And most importantly, I would like to recognize my incredible parents. Mom, from the moment I was born, people have judged and doubted your capabilities. But despite all the adversity, you have provided me an incredible life and showed me your constant support, for which I am for always grateful and promise to continue making you proud for as long as I live. Papá, estoy muy agradecido por todo lo que me has hecho, has hecho por nuestra familia. Sin ti, nunca estuviéramos donde estamos hoy. Espero que algún día puedas ser el hombre que eres tú. Y estoy increíblemente orgulloso de ser tu hijo y poder llamarte papá. I would like to end this by congratulating the class of 2023 on our hard work and wishing all of us a successful life and career. Thank you so much. And we have one more student uh, speech. It will be our student body president, Alani Borboa. <laughs> Welcome administration, parents, and class of 2023. My name is Ailani Borboa, your 2022 to 2023 school year student body president. I just wanted to say thank you to everyone who came out on a very special day to support us. Thank you to all the teachers who had put up with us for four years and mostly our parents for putting up us forever. I want to give a big shout out to Farah. He is always there for me and helped me through anything. <sighs> I've been in his class for four years, which felt like forever because he always talks a lot. <laughs> he really is like my school dad because how much we would argue in student council about the little things. But it wouldn't be a graduation speech without mentioning him because every class before me has mentioned him. Anyways, enough about Fara. <laughs> One more big thank you to a person that impacted my life so much. This is for Bianca Gonzalez. She is one of the strongest women I know. In my whole childhood, she was my role model, and she still is. Seniors, as we eventually arrive at our final destination, 
We look in awe and utter fascination at the memories made and the experience shared with our peers. The countless moments adorned with laughter and all the silly jokes, how the four years did fly by. We sprouted wings and now we all must say goodbye. Our teenage years will lay unforgettable. Not a moment in this life has been regrettable. We have helped one another form and grown into strong, independent men and women. Our future story, who's to know? We all longed for our senior year to go as slow as if time stood frozen. It still feels weird. Who knows if we're ready to depart on separate journeys and adventure, our fears stay buried inside of us. This school had made us resilient and strong, which is why we all smile even though our faces feel long from all the stress in our classes. I know we will flourish when we leave through these gates in a couple of hours. On whichever journey each of us awaits, I wish to thank those who've made us special. We've laughed, cried, loved, and learned. I hope our goodbyes are simply adjourned. I hope you all follow your dreams and never give up. Someone will always be proud of you. Thank you for letting me be your student body president. This is Ailani Borboa officially signing out. Congratulations, class of 2023. All right, next, Mr. Miranda will present the class of 2023. Yes. All right, Dr. Trujillo, Mr. Lambert, board members, honored guests, on behalf of the faculty and staff of Toya High School in Tucson, Arizona, I certify that the students here in front of you have met the requirements set forth by the state of Arizona and Tucson Unified School District and recommend the class of 2023 as qualified candidates for Choya High School Diploma. All right, families, now is the moment you've been waiting for. Um, Mr. George Para and Ms. Joy Noriega will be reading the names as we present the diplomas. All right, so all the dads, moms, nanas, and tatas in the audience, you guys ready? How about the class of 2023? You guys ready? I, I, I can't hear you. You guys ready? What's so? All right. So it's now my honor and privilege to begin presenting this year's graduating class, the Choya class of 2023. Right. Ezequiel Cristobal Valdez Salmón. Come on. Jose Andrian Abril the second. Tavia Francesca Acedo. Princess Erica Acevedo. Lexine Cheyenne Aguilar. Ruby Mariel Alarcón Inda. Jamie Nicole Aleman Mejia. Beautiful. 
Adrian Nicolás Alonso. Naomi Yanitza Alvarez. Valeria Janet Alvarez Navarro. Noah Jesus Humberto Alviar. Timothy Lee Anderson. Jasmine Ariel Armenta Cariño. Lisa Esperanza Arvizu. Be the next one. Carlos Fernando Arquizo Jr. Senova Marie Badia. Alexis Rene Ballesteros. Marlette Ballesteros. Ailani Michelle Barboa. Isaí Gerardo Breton. Valeria Isabel Briseño Fuentes. Rachel Tatiana Brown. Daniel James Bryant. James Enrique Burrell. Letsy Cristina Bustamante. Franz Joseph Cabinlet. Carlos Armando Camacho Jr. Jonathan Camarena. Nevea Sky Pearl Camu. Alexis Campos Martinez. Jesus Francisco Campoy Ley. Daniel Emilio Cañez. Natalie Janine Carvajal. Roderick James Carr. Mariana Castellanos. Fernanda Castellanos Robles. Gabriel Antonio Castro. Susan Yaelin Casares Galaviz. Nathan Andres Casares Vega. Jada David Cervantes Garcia. Danae Grace Chaboya Stauffer.
María Paula Chiquete. Roman Patrick Coleman. Natalina Marisa Contreras. Jimena Córdoba Noriega. Dalen Sean Cornelli. Alexander Coronado Acuña. Jesús Roberto Cortés. Arisa Cota. Lázaro Alberto Cota. Victoria Melinda Cota. Atsiri Cuevas. Ryan Keith Day. Masai Amari Dean. Yareli Giselle Diaz. Yes, Congratulations. Flora Teresa Diaz Lucio. Gwen Dui Do. Mariah Isabella Doe. Sierra Alexis Dominguez. Adrian Alejandro Drake Mora. Johanna Elodia Duarte Ramirez. Malachi Deshaun Ifan. Eduardo Echeverria Sandoval. Edgar Adrian Elias. Amber Enriquez. Marisa Ramona Enriquez. Fabian Michael Escobedo. Celeste Luz Espinosa. Jaciel Daniel Espinosa. Okay. Adrian Brandon Felix. Brian Fernandez Duran. Flor de Azucena Fernandez Hernandez. Maya Celeste Pontes Santoyo. Reyes Hermilo Fuentes. Elías Alejandro Galvez Gámez. Adrian Federico Gámez Cota. Mia Valeria Gandaría.
Adri Fernanda García. Alessandra Marie García. Iliana Benicia García. Esteban Ernesto García. Iriana Cristal García. Jesse García. Dandy Arad García Hernández. Elizabeth Sofía Gastelum. Angelina Yasmín Gómez. Mia Isabel Gómez. Sienna Ray González. Wilfrido Gracia. Juan Bautista Griego Quintana. Zuleika Monique Tautimés Grijalva. Elías Mauriano Guzmán. Eliseo Andrés Guzmán. Gregory Glenn Hall. Mariah Orlean Ham. Anthony Christian Enrique Haro. Carlos Manuel Haro. Jayla Lynn Hayes. Tyson Elliott Helms. Alicia Lachey Henry. Angel Gabriel Hernandez. Bailey Jessel Hernandez. Erasmo Ángel Hernández. Julián Nicole Hernández. Zuleika Hernández. Jonathan Alexander Herrera. Lian Alberto Herrera Casabantes. Dexeray Alejandra Higuera. Roberto Jesús Higuera. Tom Mariano Holland Beltrán. Cristian Tomás Hoshiko Jones. Dominic Juan Humo. Charles Elliot Ingram. 
Jaden Herschel Jackson. Miguel Angel Jaime Bermudez. Angelica Jimenez Jimenez. Jasmine Nerisa Jimenez. Daniel James Johnson. Faith Arlena Jose. Alan Emanuel Juarez. Luis Roberto La Madrid. Jose Emanuel Lee Lopez. Santiago Fabian León. Lisha Jasbeck León Carrasco. Josephine Lynn Lindner. Ready? Madison Brooke Living Good Wood. Jaden Nathaniel Lofton. Angelita Victoria Lopez. Darian Thomas Lopez. Jessica Marie Lopez. Jose Martin Lopez. Lisa Lee Lopez. Luis Angel Lopez. Priscila Mayret Lopez Garcia. Alexa Samra Lopez Orduñez. Ready? Jessica Ramirez Loreto. Monique Anisset Loya. Steven Daniel Lozano Jr. Sasha Ian Luke. Isaac William Madrid. Lily Diane Manis. Devin David Marine. Valerie Amber Marquez. Devin Charles Martin. Samia Quanis Martin. Alia Austin Martinez. Ready? Alyssa Dominique Martinez. Diane Alejandra Martinez. Okay. 
Dominic Martinez. Fierla Isenia Martinez. Ricardo Martinez Delgado. Felipe Martínez Rodríguez. Ashanti Monique McGee. Joseph Marco Medina. Nathan Medina. Alexis Annette Mejia. Jose Juan Arturo Mejia. Jasmine Melendres. Benjamín Sabino Méndez. Damián Mendivil. Giselle Verónica Mendivil. Elario Iván Mendoza. Fritz Mac Mendoza. Hazy Yasmin Mendoza Espinosa. Marquez Mesa. Catherine Marie Miller. Adan Miranda. Eileen Yvette Miranda. Jennifer Miranda. Take it Jennifer Alexandra Miranda Robles. Ashley Raceli Molina. Kiara Sofia Monreal. Annalise Karina Montiel. Mia Angelina Morales. Oscar Manuel Morando Sotelo. Gabriel Roxanne Moreno. Malia Alasia Moreno. Miguel David Moreno. Anik Siana Moreno Granillo. Matthew Glenn Muirhead Jr. Dixabel Mungarro. Araceli Isabel Navarro. Jacob Anthony Ochoa.
Jeffrey Alexander Oliva Morales. Alejandro Isaiah Orona. Dana Paola Oropesa Nevares. Natalie Elise Horta. Alexia Sarai Ortiz. Divani Marilene Ortiz. Nicholas Ortiz. Rogelio Osuna Valdez. Montserrat Rasami Odum. Joseph Francisco Pacheco. Yes. Isabella Amaya Padilla. Kristen Ryan Parkhurst. Salma Parra. Olivia Monet Parsons. Juliana Yvette Pedroselli. Antonio Ascensión Peralta. Mark Anthony Perez. Michael Angelo Perez. Casiel Ulysses Pesquera. Orion Samuel Petrie. Nirvik Pokret. Emily Abigail Kiwis. Oh, cool. Julian Quijada Montiel. Carolina Teresita Quintana. Francisco Arnoldo Quintana Espino. Anthony Quintero. Leila Quiroz. Kevin Alexis Ramirez. Mark Antonio Ramirez. Michelangelo Corona Boss. Steve Anthony Rascón Jr. Sebastian Rascón Ruiz. Kieran Rath. Quinton Robert Redden. Red. Seth Michael Redden. Vincent Alexander Redden. Caitlin 
Rose Rayner. <laughs> Candy Gabriela Reyes. Anifa Eileen Rivas. Gabriel Ismael Rivas. <laughs> J.C. Ryan Cesar Robles. <laughs> Isabela Rocha. <laughs> Elias Rodriguez. Ismael Rodriguez. <laughs> Julius Joseph Rodriguez. <laughs> Leilani Kalia Armasan Rodriguez. <laughs> Selena Braylene Rodriguez. David Rojo Orduño. Robert Brian Romero. Jennifer Romero Castellanos. Jesús Manuel Romero Urrea. Cristian Esteban Romo Gutiérrez. Brian Anthony Rosas Hernández. Carlos Alberto Ruelas Fimbres. Daniel Dionisio Ruiz. Jose Manuel Ruiz. Oscar David Ruiz Parra. Garisa Lizde Salazar. Alondra Jimena Saldana. Casar Talía Samaniego. Anaís Ariel Sánchez. Ready, take it slow. Hennessy Janae Sanchez. Clarissa Isabel Sanchez. Ah! Erica Juliana Sandoval. Skauyumari <laughs> Santoyo. <laughs> Aleska Atena Salcedo Fuentes. Scott Thomas Sears Jr. Jasmine Lisette Serrano. Edwin Sierra Hernandez. Francisco Javier Silva Ríos. Leonardo Jesús Skorupski. No. Derek Smith. Okay. Judith Maribel Sobampo Hernández. 
Marcos Manuel Solís. Anthony Raymond Soto. Brianna Elizabeth Soto. Abigail Marie Talley. Sergio Tadeo Tapia. Jasmine Alyssa Teran. Michael Anthony Testa. Right. Hector Alfonso Torres Valenzuela. Okay. Ire Trujillo Enriquez. Hello. Juan Valdez. Nathan Ray Valdez. Laisha Giovanna Valdez Garcia. Dimas Jonathan Valencia. Juan Luis Valencia Daniel. Elena Cristina Valenzuela. Luz Elena Valenzuela. Angelina Valenzuela Mezquita. Angélica Stefania Valenzuela Pro. Jonathan Joel Valenzuela Sotelo. Kila Valle Fuentes. Julia Judith Varela. Jose Alonso Vargas. Miguel Velarde Rodríguez. Isaiah Velasquez. Christian Tadeo Velasquez Escobar. Rene Genesis Verdugo Machado. Carlos Benito Vidal. Victor Manuel Vidana. Abril Vidrio Velázquez. Angel Hashim Villanueva Valverde. Ready? Roberto Luis Villavicencio. José Francisco Villegas Encinas. Adrian Fernando Viramontes. Elijah Jacob Weber. Alizea Ashley Webb Smith. Nayeli Idani Welberg. Siren Williams.
Matthew Enrique Williams. 